Well, good afternoon, everybody. It is uh, terrific to have you along for our live coverage of this uh, eagerly awaited contest. It should provide some terrific entertainment on uh, what is turning into a rather imperfect afternoon. The weathermen rarely get it wrong, and uh, they have warned us that there is rain on its way. Shouldn't be bad enough in any sense meaningfully to impact on the game of football, but it is a factor to be taken into consideration. Plenty of other factors, of course, principally each side's concern for the strengths of the other. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Porto have gone with what looks like an orthodox 4-4-2, Jim. Well, the obvious standout in today's football in this system is that it provides you with extra presence in attack. With many shaky defences about, getting the right partnership in that department can pay rich dividends as long as there's a good early supply. So playing two strikers can, um, can be a real help to this team. In 4-4-2 these days, Peter, gets a lot of criticism, but it's, it's unfair. Any system can work if you've got the right players. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Gets it back. Sessignon. Chambers plays it forward. Rahimi. Alex Tellez tries to get it forward quickly. He's got away. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Babel. Now it's Mitrovic. Ball. Who's going to get that? Kenny Cecil pushes it out wide. Herrera hoops it to safety. And it's Brahimi. Gets into some space. He's left his man. Got a sight of goal here. Out to the left it goes. Goal kick. No. Oh, I stand corrected. It's a corner. And it's been taken short. All driven towards the far post. Knocks it away. Reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Lovely bit of skill. And helps available out wide. And it's kept out by a stubborn defence. Danilo Pereira. Cecilio goes looking. Got through to him, he's got it, and he's got time. Barbell drilled in low. Fulham have it back, and they can go again. He's had a go, and he's done it. Half time imminent. What a time to score! And however many surrounded him. That is what he can do. Mitrovic demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play.
A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Pepe. And that'll be the last act of the first half. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. And if we're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Porto need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Brahimi. Alex Tellez. Herrera. Well weighted. Second half off to a spectacular start. Porto produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it is a strong end product. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, what a convincing response to going behind. They've got all the momentum now. Bubble. And the shot! Bubble. Now it's Mitrovic. Mitrovic! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Kearney plays it short. Kenny. Play for a throw. And it's Chambers. Surely a shot. And he's there to hoof it away. Chambers, and that's been levered clear. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And it's hoisted clear. Bubble! A great save, real class. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. Gets up to head it! Attempt, just the wrong outcome. Mitrovic did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again.
Brahimi. Over to the left. Look at the defender bombing forward. Get that clear. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. The referee's awarded a free kick. Barbol swept in. Mitrovic has a goal. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. And that is that. Well, no winner here, but an intriguing game. The result, probably a fair reflection. It has finished all square. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? A rather flat performance for me when we expected something a lot stronger. I think they thought the win would just come to them, and it didn't. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.